Hello ladies and gents. So today's mission is to go to the studio and record an album. Maybe get two albums done, two albums worth of music done. And that is because I have recorded all the rough drafts of my songs in my own home studio. But I want to keep that quality up, especially if I'm going to be, you know, selling the music. I want to keep that quality up for the listeners. So I like to record my tracks at home first to get a little vibe. And then I'm going to go ahead and take them to Vocal Inc. to max it out for me. So uh, I got to get in the car now and drive. And, you know, you shouldn't vlog and drive. So I'll touch back in a little. got some gas, cut my little healthy energy kick vibe. It's just a little breakfast smoothie with some like fruit and yogurt and such, Nutri-Grain bar, just so I can get that boost of energy to make these banger ass tracks. You gotta buckle the buckle the up. So I arrived at the studio, I'm about 15 minutes early, so I figured I would just add this little tidbit in, give him a little bit of time to end whatever session he might already be on, and uh, go over my songs and shit like that. So like I was saying, I went ahead and I recorded my albums at my home studio, that way I'd have like, you know, the music to listen to, I could test out the lyrics and things of the sort, and then I'm taking that and then going to the studio, re-recording all the songs, which I highly recommend to other artists out there because it's like, then when you go to record at the official studio, then you will have your flow down, your cadences down, all the lyrics will be down, and then plus you got the practicing at your home studio of engineering and things of the sort, but then by going to another one, you get that perfect professional sound. So I definitely recommend that to you if it's in your budget. And don't get me wrong, nothing is wrong with home studios, but if it is definitely in your budget to go to a proper studio, then do that. But home studios are definitely great for getting with your com comfortability and just getting your songs down at least a rough draft so here we are back in the old classic vocal link studio this one is now called studio a and then there's a door across the street now called studio b so uh you guys should definitely go ahead and check out the website check out timmy online vocal link production pretty much everywhere but um like i was saying i'm pretty much gonna go try to go through as much of creating recreating this album as possible and uh get to it you dig Big boy tip, remember to put them phones on silent, that way you don't get no unsolicited text messages in the song. So first song we're gonna try and do is small. I was just talking to the camera. All right, let me try that again. All right, so at this point, I gave up on doing small, and then I went ahead and just decided to start doing two shots. I took two, sh I took two shots now. Okay, okay, okay. Fuck it. Yeah. So Timmy's mixing that now. And uh, you know, sometimes you just gotta give up and push on instead of dwelling on something that ain't working. It be like that. Do you got just what it takes, kid? Well, I'm dumb, stupid, and young. Jim and about the green, but I never had none. So we're coming to the end of the session. I ended up messing up this whole vlog thing because I got caught up in the music as I should, I guess. But uh, definitely tune in for more. I got more videos coming out. I'm on my shit now. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, like, and whatnot. And uh, say hi to Timmy. What say hi, Timmy. Hey, what's your Insta? Oh, never mind. Hey, yeah, gourmet everywhere. You dig?